Freaking right, that's better than yesterday. Welcome to 647. Not a cloud in the sky, San Diego blue. It's 8.16 a.m., unfortunately only 43 degrees, which is pretty freezing if you ask me. But we've got a heated seat on on the low setting, and it is a beautiful morning from inside the cabin of the car, even with Ohio cornfields, which I usually don't see unless I'm on the way to Columbus or something, but I guess they do exist up where I live, I just don't see them. I feel like that's the stereotype, Ohio, what do we have, horses, fields, and corn. And living in northeastern Ohio, I don't really think of it that way. It's much more suburban uh, neighborhoods and stuff like that. But there is corn if you go out, out of where I am anyways. Horses, not so much. I mean, maybe if you drive way down. I've driven to Marietta and back, down on the river. And um, it's kind of just woods. It's all woods down there. And it starts to get hilly as you get into the Appalachians. And by the way, the south starts, like the south that we all think of, that starts south of Columbus, not down in Kentucky or Tennessee. It starts in Ohio. You get down to Cincinnati or Marietta, you're in the south. Oh my God, Jesus freaks. All right guys, we'll talk more about that later. I gotta go to class. This looks good. I think they just did this this year. Yeah. Twin Lakes. They have not flooded due to all the rain yet. There's a surprise. This is very normal, speed limit 45, uh, we're just got up to 35 now, we've been in the 20s, there's a um, cement truck up here that pulled out, there is not a car in front of that cement truck for miles and miles and miles, and I wish we'd get another hill here, so you could see there's 20 to 30 cars ahead of me, 6 feet from each other, and then there's another 30 behind me. Why can't trucks keep up with traffic? I'll never understand. Yes, I, I do understand that they're heavy and they require a lot of power and they take a lot longer to stop when they're carrying so much shit, but downhill, can't you at least go the speed limit? That's what I ask. There he is, son of a bitch. Added five minutes to my commute today. Thanks, bud. Looks like we have cartoon clouds from Springfield here, for freak's sakes. Shaky the camera guy here. I just got done mowing and I filmed a video for, uh, for Ryan Knows Tech. iPad, iOS 6 on the TV. I don't know how it turned out at all. It could be awful. I may not even upload it. If it's viewable, I'll throw it up. It's going to take some editing. It's like 15 minutes. Anyways, two yards. I hate doing more than one at a time because it just sucks, but I got the two hard ones done. They were longer than I would have liked across the street. So plus money in the pocket. In fact, I never took it out. I hope it's still there. Yeah, there we go. Check and cash. So I'm going to try not to forget, tonight I need to talk about iPhone naming and Apple product naming and there's something else I was going to talk about. Crap. Hopefully I remember before I publish this video. Alright, 10.40. Um, talked with Mike for about an hour and a half on Skype. Tech informed plans, tons of stuff about the future. It's good to get that done. Uh, I've got a couple things I need to print for tomorrow and I'm going to talk about those iPhone names tomorrow because it's too late, and I'm tired, I want to get to bed. That's going to take some time and some more brain power than I have right now. So we'll talk about I, Apple names tomorrow, and whatever else I was trying to come up with, let me know if you think there's something else I should talk about. Uh, tomorrow, 6.47, Figure it out tomorrow. Good night. All right, I just figured out what I was going to talk about. The other thing is that protest slash standing up for beliefs at Kent today. I'll talk about that tomorrow too. Good night.